Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo from the BJ Tech News, the only place where you could get your daily tech report, tips and tricks on hardware and software, and also geeky related topics. So today's video is all about how to skip the start screen and boot to the desktop in Windows 8. Now, this is Windows 8. I'm going to log into my account. I'm logging in. And then when you log in, you get you go to the start menu uh, what's up with that it was supposed to go into the boot Now Microsoft was a little bit of smart and what happened was they added the option for you to skip it it will automatically go into your start you know screen your metro or your modern UI or whatever they call it nowadays uh, the reason why it boots straight to this is because Microsoft wants you to start using this uh, it is user friendly you just gotta use it alright guys but I'm going to show you how to bypass it. So let's go to the desktop. You want to right click anywhere in the taskbar. You want to go to properties and then you're going to go to navigation. Now as you can see there's a bunch of more options or new features that they added within the navigation uh, tab. tab. Uh, the start screen as you can see go to the desktop instead of the start when I sign in. So let's, uh, let's click on that. They also got like show my desktop background start always show start on my main display when I press the Windows logo key show the apps view automatically when I go to start uh, list desktop apps first in the apps view when it's sorted by calorie uh, future videos I'm gonna show you guys what it does but I wanna focus more on this one so let's hit apply okay and let's let's log off so what I wanna do is uh, because I'm on a virtual machine I'm gonna send it a control delete and I'm gonna sign out uh, once I'm signed out I'm gonna let's sign back in I'm gonna sign in and let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. And it boots right to the desktop. Awesome. Again, uh, Microsoft allowed you to, it, not allowed you, but it, they gave you the option to turn it off and on. So it's pretty, pretty cool. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video of how to skip the start screen and boot to the desktop in Windows 8.1. Uh, please leave, it, leave comments below. Uh, if you guys have any questions or any comments about this new feature, I think it's pretty good. It's great. I've been using Windows 8 for a while, and I I'm loving it. Uh, please leave comments below again. Uh, please like, and i catch you guys on the next video. Peace out!